we're going to hop on over to Bruce to hopefully Hello. get back to work. <laughs> Get busy. He's busy saving people. He can get some work done. <laughs> no, I'm off I'm, now. I'm he's sitting done. in the office. Okay. Got to get the pager to my relief, but he'll come over. Okay, good. Good. We don't have to worry about any people. You don't have to worry about any people. We're all set and ready to go. I'm going to give a quick reread of your plot synopsis since we're a little bit removed from that, and we'll hop right in. Bruce Davis gives us a fabulous story of what it truly means to be good neighbor. With all the divisiveness and difficulties in the world, this is a story we, we need right now, one filled with optimism, acceptance, and community connection. So one thing that jumped out to me immediately about your story was the setting. Could you maybe tell me a little bit about your setting that you chose for well, the story and why you chose it? It's uh, Depression era, 1930s, Eastern Kentucky, or Western Kentucky, I mean, out between the land between the rivers, Tennessee and Kentucky rivers. Absolutely. Yeah, I, I noticed that with the mention of the TVA. 